Okay, so the part five of Smart Mobile in the chapter three, what we're going to do now is look at how to install the configurable data model that you created on your computer onto the device because now we have installed the APK or the application file known as Smart Mobile. So uh, the first thing you want to do is in your smart conservation area that is open on your desktop, the first thing you want to do is left click field data, left click smart mobile and now we're going to export. So export taking from the computer sending it to the device, importing is taking it from the device into the computer. You will need to know that at a later stage in this chapter. So we're going to export the patrol package, left click. The export location, you need to make sure that the device is connected and that's where we want to send it. Left click on this arrow to make sure that you are choosing the correct data, configurable data model that you chose. So in this case, SAWC underscore SM. Cyber tracker property, so that's you leave that as default because that's the changes that you made. Now we're going to also add a base map. So click this drop down arrow and choose the SAWC base map. It's going to then choose the boundaries and the references. And the zoom type, you're going to change it to what it looks like in the picture or in your manual. Click left click the uh, drop down arrow, choose 9 and left click at the max to 14. Okay, we don't need to worry about this one at the bottom and then we left click export. So what it will do, it will package the base map, it will package everything together and it's actually going to then send it to your device as a .zip file. Uh, so now it is now going to process the attributes, so the fauna and flora, or the animal, plants and incursions that you have, as well as the cyber tracker property. As you can, as you can see, the package has been successfully sent to your device, and you click OK. So what now you're going to do is look at your smart mobile on your device. So this is my device in front of me. If I Touch these top three here, or I just click this back button, and this phone button. I can actually find the smart mobile app, which is here. I click that, and it'll automatically detect it. Um, but that is where your configurable data model is now sitting on your device. The next step is going to collect data and how are we going to do that in the field. So go ahead and send the configurable data model to your devices now.